Good morning. We are here bright and early. It's a after seven. We are on the security side of Harbor. We are going to Disney California Adventure today. Um, and we're going to rope drop Radio Springs Racers. We're gonna see how it works because now that early entry has changed and there are not going to be guests already in the park. We wanna see how, how it works because before I used to recommend rope dropping racers. But ever since early entry guests have been in the park, they got in ahead of you and it was kind of a waste of time in the morning. So let's see how it goes today. All right, we made it through security, really short lines. We were entering on the harbor side. Um, it's about 7.10. We are lined up here at the gates in front of Disney California Adventure because today, early entry, those that are staying on property, they have access to Disneyland a half hour early and you can still rope drop. Anybody can rope drop. Rope drop has not changed. Rope drop starts at 8 a.m. But you want to get here before that so you can get in the parks and get lined up. So today we are here at 7.10. Like I said, they'll let us in about 7.25 and then we'll go stand in front of the ropes. We're going to wait at the ropes until they let us in at 8 o'clock. The reason we're here today at Disney California Adventure is because we want to see if we can get on racers very quickly, not have to pay for a lightning lane or stand in line for at least an hour later in the day. So we'll let you know how it goes. All right, 7.34 and they are letting us through the gate. We're gonna go rope drop Raider Springs Racer. Hey, we are walking with purpose. We're just going over here to a rope because they're gonna stop us. They're gonna block us and make us wait until eight o'clock when the park opens. But we are going to try and rope drop racers this morning. So it's about 7.36 and they just let us through the gates. And we're going to go line up, like I said, at the rope for Radio Springs Racers. I recommend doing this on Tuesday, Thursday, or Saturday when Disneyland has early entry and there's not already guests here in the park. So we're going to go line up for rope drop and we're going to try and get on racers. All right, they led us to the gates about 7.35 this morning. And you can see people are already lined up ahead of us. Not very many people, but that's where the rope is, where all those people are stopped. So that's why it's called rope drop. So at eight o'clock, they will drop that rope and they will let us through and we will head to racers. We are just walking with purpose behind everybody else. We're gonna head right straight to the ride. Hopefully it's open, we can get right on. So they stopped us right here because they're saying the attraction is not open. So we got here rope drop, we did all the right things, all the right steps, but the race, race is not open. So we're gonna chance it, see how long it takes. Cause we're right here and we already did the work. So let's see if we can get on the attraction. Hopefully it won't be too long. Okay, so they didn't tell us to walk away. Like, if the tractor really wasn't going to open at all, like for an hour or so, then I would have bailed. And if I thought they, like, either said go away, but the fact that they didn't tell us to go away, I'm like, you know what, we're going to stick it out. So it's now 8.17 and they just let us in line. So that was worth waiting for. Okay, so about 8.17, they let us get into the line for the attraction. Here are my thoughts. If the attraction was gonna be closed for a while this morning, they would not have allowed us to line up at the end of uh, Cars Land and wait. They would have been like, no, it's not gonna open and they wouldn't have even allowed us to be there. So just kind of gauge that because this happens. I mean, you plan, the, the rides aren't open at Rope Drop. And it, I feel bad for families that come and their purpose is to go on this attraction. So if the cast members are not telling you to leave, wait it out. We only had to wait 15 minutes and now we are in the line and we're going to get on the ride.
15 minutes in line. Yay! Do a quick little recap of our morning and how it went. There's Radio Springs Racers behind me. So, in the end, we got here at Rope Drop. So, we were here at 7.15. They let us in the gates a little after 7.30 and then we waited at Rope Drop. If Racers had been open right when the park opened, it would have been perfect. Okay? And some days it is open. Most days it is open, I should say. And so, we would have gotten right on and been off by 8.15 and on our way. As it was, the attraction, the cast members told us when the rope dropped, they said, we're going to let you into Cars Land, but we don't know when the attraction's going to open. The fact that they let us line up, though, gave me hope that the attraction wasn't going to be closed for very long. Because if it was going to be closed for hours in the morning, they would have said, you can't line up, and they would have pushed us away. So we thought, you know what, we're going to wait it out. We've got this. We already put in the time. Let's do this. So we chose to wait. So they stopped us just by flows and they made us stand there. And about 8.17, then they made us line up again and just go single file into the line. And we were on and off the attraction by 8.30. So even 30 minutes after rope drop, we had completed the attraction. There. Right now, the wait time is 65 minutes and we just got off the ride. So I do think it's worth it. If you can see them and they, they're telling you um, just wait or they don't have an exact time when the attraction is going to open, I would wait it out. Give it a few minutes. For us, it worked out this morning. I know when you come on vacation, this is a big ride. So there are ways that you can there are ways that you can skip the line. You can purchase a lightning lane. Sometimes that's $20, $25 a day per person. We didn't do that. I really think this is the best strategy is on a Tuesday, Thursday, or Saturday to rope drop Radiator Springs racers. <laughs> 